Google, it's great. Go. And back home. Where's my other glove? Oh. All right, guys, what's up? We're back. Finally uh, hopping on the bike again. It's been a little bit, but uh, with my, uh, my, my natural partner here, um, Travis, the bruh, the homeboy. So this video, I actually just installed a 15, te 15 tooth uh, sprocket on the front. Stock is 16 teeth, tooth, teeth, I don't know. I threw one on because it was cheap, dude. And it's supposed to give it more torque. And I'm honestly a little bit nervous because um, it's the first time I've rode her. So should make my gears a lot shorter, which is good because Honestly, man, on this bike, the gears were originally just a little too long for me because second gear will rev to, yeah, not rev, but in the top of second gear, it's like 82 miles an hour, which is fucking fast, bro. Way too fast. So basically, through the 15 in, it should make everything a little bit more usable in town because as it is now, I just stay in second gear and I never really get to shift a bunch, and I like to shift. You know, shifting's fun. Dude, <laughs> you dancing? You got the CRGs? Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah. Oh shit, we're going, we're good. Let's try it out here. Okay, okay, well, that's a little bit more acceleration. Not, not as bad as, not bad, but not as intense as I was expecting, to be honest. But it does, does pick up a little bit faster now, which is dope. I'm gonna hop over this lane. Travis just installed the Horde Power airbox on his bike uh, about a couple weeks ago. And um, I haven't read, ridden it yet, but I'm pretty sure that thing's gonna fucking slap. So I'm, I'm, I'm excited to hop on it and see what she does. switching uh turns out that the fz09 front wheel is like an eighth of an inch bigger than the 07 wheel so if you do plan on doing that swap just be uh just know that I just know it's not gonna fit dude we were bummed out because then we had to go get the front wheels powder coated and everything so um yeah i got black wheels now that's tight i like it, it looks a little more um matches my wrap better i will say with the sprocket dude the wheelie is a lot easier that's fucking sick i got the black wheels on that, that went well and then right around the time that my bike was put back together after that whole entire shindig bro like we had to take them off put them on so many times just to fucking get it done and it was finally done i was finally ready to rip and then um i got the bike wrapped which you know i wanted to do it's i'm, I'm very happy with how it turned out i took it in to get wrapped to my surprise they got it done in a day which was impressive because I just, I didn't know how long it was going to take them, and uh, I honestly expected a week, and the guy's like, oh yeah, dude, I'll have it done tomorrow. It was like, maybe like five. Well, <laughs> okay, before, I'm like, well, how long do you think it'll take? And he goes, man, maybe five. And I'm like, fuck, like five days, five weeks. He's like, 
oh, you know, five. <laughs> I'm like, five what? He's like, oh, like five o'clock tomorrow. And I'm like, really? So, dude, he ripped through this, this, um, he ripped through the wrap and finished it up really quick, which is tight, because, you know, I got to get it back. And finally the bike was put together. She was ready to rip. Still had some parts in the metal, like the tank pads to pick up, but, um, you know, that's not really crucial. And then I flew out to Boise to see my family, like the next day, which was great. I just got back. I was there for about a week and um, it was good. It was good fun. Got to see my family. Got to see my, uh, my mom, my dad, my sister, her fiance. Got to do some uh, jujitsu down there. That was pretty sick, pretty fun. Learned some new stuff, so I'm excited about that. Wanna do a little drag race? Okay. Yeah. Drag race? Second? Okay. All right. All right. He wants to race and see how this goes. Also got the sprocket in the mail last night because I got back last night about eight o'clock. So me and Travis stayed up until about I don't know one in the morning, putting the sprocket on, doing some you know, putting the sprocket on, putting the tank pads on. Those also came in the mail. Just getting some little little loose ends tight, tightened up. But um, I always say but um, but um. See if I can clutch up in third now. Just, Oh yeah, the possibilities there. As my clutch cries, I want to pass this guy, but I don't want to be uh, the bad guy. Well, homeboy's still just fucking out back there getting it, dude. Okay, Travi. The increase in torque is, it's there. It's not that apparent, to be honest. I thought it'd be, I mean, I'll hit first gear and... I mean, that's, it always did that in the past, so, but first gear is very fucking torquey as always. A little bit more torque. I'm gonna floor tours with more torque. Dude, every gear has more torque. Does look cute. Eh. Eh. And I do want to try out this horde power. So yeah, Travis put a horde power box on this thing, air box. Looks pretty minty, but they make them like the most power, I think. So that's cool. Oh yeah, the exhaust on this thing is dope. Dope. Dude, she sounds like a fucking truck. Oh, we're good. I thought my helmet wasn't on all the way. What do you think? You can definitely tell the difference with the sprocket. Yeah. It feels good. I, dude, what, what did she start popping? Dude, she's popping a lot. I like it. Dude, I swear I didn't used to do that. It's, it's doing a lot. Yeah. Well, I'm no mechanic, but I wonder if the sprocket change would have changed anything to do with the, the, the pops, the backfires. That makes no sense to me. 
that sounds like that's definitely not what it is. But, you know, I'm not, uh, I don't know everything, so it definitely could be a thing that I just never heard of before. Slaps. I love it. Oh, dude, he's coming. He's coming. Uh, sorry I've been gone for so long, but I am definitely back. I'll be making more content for sure. Just finally got the bike put to back together where I like it, you know, and um, definitely looking forward to making some more stuff. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Stick around for the next video. Probably be about maybe I want to try to get into a schedule where I'm uploading maybe once a week or maybe it's a good week, you know, I'll upload twice a week if I've got a lot of content, but nonetheless, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!